Gideon had questions. He said, excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Mighty man of Guinea. He said, let me ask you. Why? Why are all these things going on? Gideon kind of asked almost three questions at once. Where be all the miracles that I want to be falling on? Where be all the, these things? Where be, and Gideon had questions. And the Lord replied, Gideon. And the Lord looked upon him and said, Go in this thy mind. You see all these questions you've asked me? It's tied to strength. You see all these questions you're asking me? In other words, Gideon, the reason why the Midian prevailed for seven years is that no man of strength arose. Oh, we had men of strength that were made to believe they were weak. We had men of strength that the enemy traded their strength for weakness. And he said, Gideon, listen, your instruction is go in this time. Mind. The angel did not come to Gideon to say, Gideon, receive might. Do you understand what I'm saying? The angel only reminded Gideon, you have strength, but it's not emotion. Gideon, you are loaded, but you are sitting on your mind. Gideon, you have too many prophecies over your life. Go and redeclare the words you've received. Gideon, if you have mind, be in motion. When you have mind, be in motion. If you forget everything I said here, don't forget this one. When you have mind, be in motion. The world has no respect for mighty people that are lying down. You know, I can do this. I can do it. If you can do it, step out and do it. If you can pray, step out and pray. If you can study the word, step out and study the word. If you can take your world by storm, step out and become it. Strength that is not in motion is a mockery of destiny.